This video shows how to transform a matrix in uh, row echelon form into the reduced row echelon form. So if we look at this matrix, augmented matrix 3 by 4, it is already in its row echelon form. So to start this process, we need to start at the bottom right pivot positions. This one, the one here is a one of the pivot positions. We have another pivot positions here and then we have another pivot position here. In this one we have three pivot positions. And then we need to start with the bottom right pivot positions. And look at this pivot positions here and look at its column, the column that it belongs to. You need to make sure that the one here is the only non-zero values in this column. That means you need to transform row one and row two in such a way such that these two values here have to be zero. So we're gonna use two row operations on row one and row two. Row two is transformed by taking row two plus one seventh row three, and row one is transformed by taking row one minus one third of row three. Doing these two operations here give us a new matrix. And look at the new matrix here. You can see that the third column is already in its reduced row echelon form. Then we have to move to the left to the second pivot positions. And again, we need to make sure that this pivot position is the only non-zero values in its column, which is in the second column here. That means we have to do a row operations on the third, on the first row. So then this values here is going to be zero. So in order to do that, the row operations can be used is row one is transformed by taking row one minus two over three row two. Doing these operations, we're going to achieve a new matrix. And look at this new matrix are the columns that contains pivot positions only have the pivot pos positions as a non-zero value. So the first pivot position is the, is the only non-zero value in, the, in this first column. It's the second pivot position is also is the only non-zero value in the second column. And also the third pivot position is the only non-zero values in this column. So we already achieved the, row, the reduced row echelon form.